Obviously, the South Carolina primaries are now behind us, but that didn't stop both Republicans and Democrats from getting out tonight to catch some of the political excitement downtown. News 2's Matt Alba attended a Super Tuesday watch party and joins us live in the studio with details. Matt? Well, Brendan, a local group of law students gathered at a bar on King Street tonight to talk politics and policy. As the results poured in this evening, students from the Charleston School of Law Republican Law Club met to see who won where. The group of, uh, represents the Republican Party on campus, and organizers say they strive to provide a forum for the discussion of current events and to actively assist both the local and national branches of the party. Republican students hosted the event, but they also invited their Democratic classmates to exchange ideas and to talk about what this Super Tuesday means for both parties going forward. I just wanted to get out here and do something. There's not many um, opportunities to do something fun when it comes to politics with a group. So you're not a Republican, but you're here at the Republican Party. Well, you got to be open-minded to both sides, and that's what I believe. That's why I'm wearing purple, because I embrace both, both sides. And if you think that one side has every answer, that's the wrong answer. This has been a pretty tight race in terms of the Democrats. However, Trump, on the other hand, has been kind of just bulldogging everyone. I was very fascinated in the 08 election. 12, I kind of lost interest. And now with this election coming up, it's very interesting. It's almost like fantasy football with candidates. Tomorrow morning on News 2 Today, we will have the full Super Tuesday results. Live in the studio, Matt Alba, News 2.